the district was in a situation where we had our district administration in 11 buildings on eight different sites spread all over our 380 square miles. So it wasn't very effective or very efficient. We commissioned our architects to look at what the cost of a building would be and discovered that it was really beyond our means. That created the situation where we needed to think outside the box. Council Appreciation Week, no. It's over 500,000 square feet of shared educational space, which basically has been done on very little money using the resources we had, not going out and asking for a bond or taxing folks higher, and doing everything on a much smaller budget. The original vision was that we could house a comprehensive high school here that would house about 800 students. We have that in Renaissance High School. We have the district office, the district service center, which is kind of the front part of the building. We have a training center. We house a professional technical center where students who are in our other high schools come here for a portion of the day. We have a culinary arts center, which is actually a cafeteria as well, where our students serve lunch on Thursday and Friday to the community or anyone who wants to come. And then the back third of the building is Idaho State University, which has all of their programs in the valley here. <laughs> Students can cross over here and actually access some of our laboratories and some of our classes, and they can actually participate in some of the research functions that we do. They walk right across the hall. <laughs> we were very fortunate. Idaho State University was in essentially the same position we were. They were the ones who had the same vision of what was possible and really walked into the building and had exactly the same reaction I had had. Oh, here we could do this and there we could do that. That was kind of the beginning of, a, of the partnership. It's going to be the same. Okay. Got it? It's really about relationships and it's also about the fact that we all had a common vision about can we make a better educational environment for our students. <laughs> Dr. Clark is actually an icon in this because she thinks education is and should be sacred work. So you get the very best teachers, you get the very best facilities, and you provide and support. And that's what we do. Well, then we're already putting parameters. Having the right partners is absolutely key, not only in this project, but in virtually everything we do. Finding those right partners, folks who have the same vision that you have. I have to pray on you. <laughs> Are we ready? You know, the result of all this has been more than we ever even dreamed. Yeah, I really wanted to that.